Did we get it? We got it. All right, Zelda. This is again an excellent game. Now, as I've, as I said previously, this is uh, you know, my first 3D game. Like, like, like when I bought the N64, this was the game I was I, I that this was the game that came with it. So I have a lot of fond memories of this one. Right. So which uh, which file, did, <laughs> which fucking file did I choose? Hmm. I don't remember. All oh, right, it, it was this one. Right, so I think the sounds still good. So yeah, okay. <laughs> yes, I was using Link like r r running into the wall. Oh, wait, wait. How did I do that? Hmm. Anyway, right. So uh, last time we've got the Master Sword, and uh, Hyrule is now a fucking. Well, it's not good. Hyrule's kind of like a... You know, a barren, like, wasteland thanks to Ganondorf. The statue's one-eyed gaze pierces into your mind. Col colors are perfect. Nice, nice. Yeah, it's a lot better, isn't it? it it's especially crucial at the, at this point of the game because it's, it's incredibly, uh... Dark, and it's very easy to like f fuck up the colors. Fucking, I love how Hyrule Market's all dilapidated and with the redeads are here. Hey, did I like? How much of like adult Link did I play? Did I even get the like Kakariko? I'm having like de deja vu of going into this house and like talking to like to this dude. Did I? Hey, young man, what's happening today? If you have a Poe, I will buy it. Your card now has zero points. Come back again. I th I did talk to him, or it, like whatever, whatever the fuck that is. Sucks that good capture boxes don't exist for less than like five hundred. Oh, yeah. Or composite to HDMI. Yeah, like the one that I saw that like was really good and basically looked as good as like a, a full on RGB output from the console itself. Basically, it made the console look as good as an emulator. Uh, was like, it was something, I forget what it was called, but the guy called it a scanline converter. And it, it cost a lot of money. But it was, like, perfect. Yeah, there is no, like, 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 middle ground. You either get cheap shit that barely works, or you gotta pay up for, like, the good shit. That's just how it is. So here's Kakariko. It's, uh, it's where all the denizens of, uh, the Hyrule Market, like, went to after everything went tits up. By the way, this game looks great on the TV. Holy shit. Wahahaha! <laughs> Look at this guy. Ever since he escaped from Hyrule Castle Town, he's become even more timid. These guys are just always, like, just taking the piss on each other. I tell you, I saw him. I saw the ghostly figure of Dompei the Gravekeeper sinking into his grave. It looked like he was holding some kind of treasure. Well, you, sir, are a liar and a cheat. It'd be cheaper just to mod your console for RGB output. Straight HDMI. I mean... I I'm not opposed? How- how- uh, I need to learn how to, like, actually, uh... To do that. Should we believe what Sheik said? And go to Kakariko Village? No! I breed a new type of miniature Kuko. I call it the Pocket Kuko. I don't get goosebumps from this baby. Kukos are very good at getting lazy. Late raw risers out of bed. Haven't you heard of them before? It makes them very happy to crow. Cuckoo! Especially when it wakes up a very heavy sleeper. However, my cuckoo is not entirely happy right now. You. You look like you're good at handling cuckoos. <laughs> I... What are you implying, woman? Here, take the sake. After the cuckoo hatches, bring it to me after a while, and I'll check out its mood. What do you think? Will you try? Sure. Yay, yeah, I borrowed a pocket egg. A pocket cuckoo will hatch from it overnight. Be sure to give it back when you're done with it. 
straight HDMI as opposed to gay HDMI. Yes. Alright, so I believe there's something to do here. Okay, I can get the Song of Storms here. But this is like some straight time loop shit here. Like going on here. Yeah. I'll never forget what happened on that day, seven years ago. Grr. It's all that Ocarina of Kid's fault. Next time he comes around here, I'm gonna mess him up. What? You've got an Ocarina! What the heck? That reminds you of that time, seven years ago. Back then, a mean kid came here and played a strange song. It messed up this windmill. There we go. Song of Storms. I should get like a better like CRT at some point. You've learned the Song of Storms. Like like one of them Sony units that look really good. Oh no! A storm again? You've played the Ocarina again, didn't you? Arr. Look at how fucking mad this man is. Holy crap, do you, do you hear the windmill? It's going knucking futs. <laughs> yeah, I could see why the, uh... Why, why the windmill broke. Holy shit, I, I, I can't even concentrate on what I'm doing here. There we go. Alright, so... What we have to do here is get the uh, hook shot, I believe. God, it's... Uh, like, like the Child Link sections aren't bad, they're fine, but I, I do prefer like playing as like Adult Link. I don't know, it, it, it just like... This is the part where I think Ocarina just feels like Ocarina, like it's just... This is the part where the game over, like the tutorial's over, it's time to play the real game, you know? God, I love that sound effect. I don't know why. Alright, so I believe... Oh, here we go. Wow, got it on my first try. That's incredible. <laughs> Young man, are you fast on your feet? I may not look like it, but I'm confident in my speed. Let's have a race. Follow me if you dare. God, let me tell you, like, that counting down sound, like, always, like, made me anxious. Still does, too. I, I, don't, I don't know what it is about it. It just sounds so weird. Fuck. Fuck. Yeah, that, I was just gonna say, yeah, I think at some point the doors will just close on you. Fucking... I like how Nav is like, watch out! The time of this race was one minute, six seconds. <laughs> Young man, you were very quick to be able to keep up with me. As a reward, I'm going to give you my treasure. It's called the Hookshot. Its spring-loaded chain will pull you to any spot where its hook sticks. Doesn't that sound cool? I'm sure it'll help you. I live here now, so come back again sometime. I'll give you something cool. One more thing. Be careful on your way back. <laughs> What do you mean? There we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah, look how, like, Adult Link can actually just reach into the, into the chests now. Like, he doesn't have to, like, dive in. 
you found the hook shot. It's a spring-loaded chain that can cast out the hook things. You can use it to drag distant items towards you, or you can use it to pull yourself towards something. Okay. Neat. Yeah, the hookshot is one of my favorite items. It's just, it's so cool. <laughs> I love the noise Link makes, like, hi -ya! Like, you, you just know Link's having a ton of fun with this. Alright, these blocks, I believe... Hey, isn't that the same design that's on the door of time? Yes. God, Majora's Mask, like, beat this into my head. Never be able to forget the, the fucking, like, uh, Song of Time. And there we go. Because it's the only way to save. And this is where we come out. What are the odds? A piece of heart. You know you're playing too much of like Mario 64 when, when, when you try to like rub up against the door like that's gonna like m like make you enter it. Ah, no link, bad. How easy is it to like solder? Hey, good to see you again. I'll give you this as a memento. Oh, okay. Thanks. I'm, I'm seriously like thinking about doing some uh, some console like modding. As I said, like I really want to like put something like on the on the Genesis so I can like actually like use a real capture card with it. Like I I, I need to find my soldering kit. How much is a good soldering kit worth? Cause, cause let's theoretically say like I can't find like dads. Uh, like how much like do they usually go for? Yeah, it'd be really cool to mod to mod this too. Okay, I don't believe I can get that yet. I need the long shot for that. Yeah. Yeah, I love how there's like two types of like hook shots in this game. There's like the hook shot and then there's the long shot. For a good temp controlled one, like a hundred bucks. It's not too bad. A long time ago, there was a man in this very village who had an eye they said could see the truth. Now usually you have to train your mind's eye most strenuously to actually see the truth. But this fella, no. They say he had a different way of doing things. His house stood where the well is now. Hint, hint. Plus tips and other accessories. Hmm. I don't know what kind of, uh... Hmm. Okay, so... I only... S I think I only freed one guy. Fucking spider guys. Yes, Deagle. Like, they actually, like, responded at some point. I don't think they watch, but, you know. By the way, good morning. How you doing, Deagle? Yeah, Deagle, you just, like, missed me, like, beating, uh, like, Super Mario 64. And, and 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 on top of it, here. Let me give you a sampling of what I just uh, like did. Ah! 
If if you want to know what that is, this is how I'm playing this game right now. I've set up this TV with like a, a VCR attached here so I can play these games at like zero latency. And I'm just this is how we this is how we do business for it like right now. So I just so at some point I just put in like the, the videotape of Sonic the Hedgehog like the anime and I've just been like playing it like on and off as I was getting really frustrated over Super Mario 64. Yeah. It was a whole lot of fuck, let me tell you. Wait, so so you're streaming Ocarina of Time while playing Mario 64? No? No, Tech, I'm talking to Deagle. Like, shut up. Hey, young man, a grown boy like you entering a person's house without permission? Oh, a grown boy without permission. I, I want to talk to your parents. Oh, well. This isn't my house anyway. This is the Great Impa's house. Uh, the Great Impa has gone to the graveyard to seal up the humongous creature there. Since Ganondorf appeared, many monsters have been sighted around here. Only the Great Impa has kept peace in our village. You have to remember that, young man. Oh well. Speaking of the Great Impa, she hasn't come back yet. I wonder what happened to her. I heard that the ghost of the Gravekeeper often appears in the graveyard behind this village. But no big deal. I should enter his house, like, now, since I'm here. Mario 64 was on the TV in the pick. Yes, because it's an old pick tech. Shut up. Shut up. Shush. You think you're funny? Hmm? See, like, I, I make the jokes here. Alright, buddy? <clears throat> <laughs> the I am like the funny man here. I think Dompe has like a unique uh, diary entry. Oh yeah, keep in mind, Deagle. <laughs> because of my like really weird setup, like I won't be able to like see Discord messages. So keep that in mind. And also, I'm gonna like wait until like BRBs or beginning ends of stream to like watch like vods. Because it's getting really hard to track them, and like my other video also got blocked in Deadmark, so it's gotta. I gotta stop watching VODs in the middle of fucking like the screams. Gravekeeper's diary is here. Do you want to read it? Yes. Whoever reads this, please enter my grave. I will let you have my stretching, shrinking keepsake. I'm waiting for you, Dompe. Oh no, he's waiting. God, these backgrounds look so good on the TV, by the way. This game looks great on like an actual CRT. Two days ago. Okay. Why are these people on Twitch? I just noticed few people in my chat and the name OMG. I bet I know their bots as well. No views and the names are Oh Wow Wrong Hole, Naughty Wife Next Door, Male Enlargement Pills, Hot Local Mom, Is It In Yet? Yeah, sounds like my my stream. I sometimes have kids in my chat and I don't want them seeing this. I have the user banned just in case. But unf. Unfortunately, the way the Twitch chat is for from the 90s, he lets them stay in the chat. What? I am male enlargement pills. I will leave your chat now. Sorry. You got any spare pills, mate? Lol. What the fuck are these? Fucking bu like, What is going on here? Plenty of Twitch handles have zero views because they don't stream. Eh. Okay, I... Whatever. Listen, I don't know what's going on. I can't be asked. Who cares? It's fine. Boy. You know Mario 64? Like, I mean... I can see, like, the aliasing on my TV. Like, I, I never realized it, like... It was a thing, but yeah, like, I guess the N64 was really low resolution, like, like wasn't it? I mean... It's just the way it is. Hey, did I rescue Epona? No, I remember. I saved at the ranch, and then I, I, I remember now, yeah. Holy shit. Right, this is the uh, the fastest way to travel. Is just by backing up.
Ooh, ooh, boy. <laughs> no, I just have to do all this at night. Can I actually do this without, like, the pocket cuckoo? That's a texture. Yeah, so apparently the ranch is owned by, uh... This guy now, instead of Talon. There are some people in Kakariko spreading rumors that I cheated Talon out of the ranch, but... Don't be ridiculous! That guy Talon was weak. I, the hard-working Ingo, poured so much energy into this place. I don't want any strangers like you saying anything bad about me. Listen. The great Ganondorf recognized my obvious talents and gave the ranch to me. I will raise a fine horse and win recognition from the great Ganondorf. Say, young man, do you want to ride one of my fine horses? Pay me ten rupees and you can ride. Okay. Do you want to hear how to ride? Ah, I know how to do it. Thank you so much. <laughs> so here's how this works. Like, you can ride one of those horses, but what we're after is Epona. There she is. And she won't come to you until you do this. I remember how this goes. There you are. Okay, now we gotta just get on and off the horse. That That's good. That's exactly what we gotta do. There we go. Yeah, horse riding. Nope. Oh, it's uh, it's more awkward than I remember. what I have to do to, to get him to, like, recognize me. I believe just go over this twice. Come on. Damn it. Hey, time's up, young man. You only paid ten rupees. you played around long enough. Okay. Okay. Like, what do I have to do? Like, faff around, like, for, for longer? God damn it. I think I gotta go over, like, the big one, like, several times. Not entirely sure. Yeah, I definitely need, like, a better CRT at some point. Damn it. For fuck's sake. Got my money back. Ah, oh, suck my ass. Forget the exact like stipulation to like get him to like recognize me. Hmm? Do I have to do it with like a regular horse first? I've completely forgotten how to, how to actually do this. I forgot, like, Link just smacks the horse on the ass.
This horse will not go over the big one. <laughs> over the... Well, I've completely forgotten how to do this. And I... For fuck... No, 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 I'm not paying any... I ain't paying any more for this shit. Do I gotta play this now? It's been a long time since we've had a visitor here. Where did you come from? Since Ganondorf came, people in... I think I've read this dialogue, haven't I? Yeah, last time. Malin's all grown up now. She has melons. <clears throat> right, town's not actually here. It's over at Kakariko. Um, has that chicken hatched yet? I think I gotta wake him up as part of this quest. Fine, I don't really need the horse yet, but I kind of wanted to like unlock it as soon as possible so I don't have to like keep running through the fucking field over and over. Yeah, well, whatever. Look at the size of that moon. Uh. <laughs> Why did it raise like a little bit and then just stop? What? <laughs> Wait, what? I never noticed. What? What do you mean? Why did the moon? Why did the moon just raise like a little bit in the sky and then just stop for a couple seconds? What's that guy's doing? Yeah, rolling. All right. I'm gonna return to the Kokiri Forest as a Dalton yeah. and holy shit, Big Duke Deku Baba. Shit. Yeah, come here. <laughs> I knocked him right out of that grass thing with a bomb. That's great. Holy crap, he's so big. Fills the entire screen as an adult. Holy shit. Mm -hmm. yeah, that looks great uh, on the CRT. Oh, yeah. Yeah, sorry if I'm a bit less, uh, le less energetic for this game than I was for Super Mario 64, but, uh, I mean, I can't be full piss mode all the time, and, like, like this game's kind of, like, uh, like, uh, has, has, has that chill factor, anyway, so. Right, so all the Kokiri are currently indoors, just hiding from these things. 
when I gotta go to the forest grotto again. Why is that fairy following you around? You're not one of us. I see. You didn't have any problems entering the forest, mister. Did the meanies out there bother you much? But before the great Deku tree died, you wouldn't see things like that around here. Since it's dangerous outside, I always stay inside my house. But I'm bored to death in here. Yeah, all the Kakiri are just in here. Ah, we gotta go to the Lost Woods. Yeah, no, this is a... Uh... It's an old Panasonic TV that I just found. Like, um, it used to be on the... Like, it was in my bedroom, and then I just brought it in here because I, I didn't want to, like, deal with it. <laughs> like, I want to actually use the uh, fucking... The, uh, you know... The shelf or something. What are you? Though you wear co Kokiri-ish clothing, you can't fool me. I promised Soraya I would never let anyone go through here. Uh... No, that's not it. Eh. No, I, I got this. Yeah, there we go. That's, that's the right song. Yeah, that's what we're meant to do. Fuck. I got it. <laughs> I can't fucking remember this shit sometimes. That melody. Sorry, I played that all the time. Do you know Sorry? That song. Sorry, I taught that song to only to her friends. Okay, I trust you. When I see you, I don't know why, but I remember him. Looks like the great Mido is a bit uh, sentimental. When I see you, I don't know why, but I remember him. Okay, can't see same thing. <clears throat> and just smash cut to the fucking like Lost Woods thing. I got it, he says as he fucks up 27 times. No, it's fine, like, I did it, 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 it. Why'd the music restart? Wait, hold on. Uh. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, Scarecrow's song, so good. From here on, we'll be going through some narrow passages if you take it slow, maybe you can sneak up on some enemies. Use Z-targeting to always look in the proper direction. Set your view so you can see down the next corridor before you turn a corner. Once your view is set, hold down Z to sidestep around the corner. Yeah, yeah, thank you. I know how to play the game. I know how to play! Thank you. Oh, God. Fucking moblins. Oh, Jesus. Gotta wait for him to fuck off. Oh, come on. You're getting a bomb up your asshole. Hope you realize this. Of course, it tell uses the Z target because it's the only way to control the camera in this game. Yeah, I remember this. Fucking, like, moblins are just, like, patrolling the corridors out here. That's alright, the bomb will get him. Bomb didn't get him. Did you know Link wears, like, earrings? Oh, for God's sake. <laughs> ha! 
How? Or do earrings wear Link? That is a good point. You know, you know, this was the version of Link that they made a bombshell because, like, one of the, uh, like, the director's, like, wives was like, Make him hot. Fuck! Just bombs! Eat bombs! There, got him. <laughs> what do you want, Navi? Worried about Saria, too. Hey, let's talk to her. Wanna talk to Saria, right? Yes. Link? There's a Saria, can you hear me? Great, you're safe. I knew I would hear from you again. I'm in the forest temple. The, the forest spirits were calling for help, so I went to check it out. But it's full of evil monsters. Help me, Link. You wanna talk to Saria again? Yes. <laughs> but, yeah. There's a lot of dialogue I missed just by, like, not talking to Saria all the time, but like, I don't give, like, two fine fucking shits, so... There. Here's one for you. Link is hot. Yeah, I, I, uh, I could probably. As long as we keep releasing that content, we'll be able to drive. Now, or do you find that more girls are playing? And I ask this question because I've heard from very yeah, reliable sources earring. about Link, the character Link. That Link is hot. Is Link hot to you? Uh, Link is hot. <laughs> I gotta say, Link is hot. But yeah, but he's more. a good-looking guy. Link is hot. Hmm? What? Yeah, I triggered something when I did that. Must be this way. No? What is going on here? Now that is nonsense. Okay, can I, like, really just sneak up and kill him? He seems to hear me, like, if I... What is this magical nonsense? You like, like, these, these enemies just pull out of their ass. The mobs are the only way I can, like, I can effectively kill these fuckers. Hey, I hear, I hear that. Where is he? Yeah, there he is. Yeah, I can do this now. Yeah, there we go. Beautiful. Hey, want to see the only way to pull out the sword without, without swinging it? This is how. Yeah. You gotta hit B while doing, like, a backflip. <laughs> it's the only way. Oh, no, he's not gonna hear me when I do this, am I? Okay, now e ease up on the analog stick. Ha-ha! Oh. I hate you. I hate this fucking enemy. Suck my mug. No, come on. And they designed it in such a way where if you pull yourself up while while he's still watching, you can't do anything because the animation plays and he's already like on his way to like ram that fucking spear up your ass. This is what I think. That works? Okay. Whatever you say. Right, and, and here's this. Yeah, just spin. Holy crap. Frame rate's got a little crusty there. Oh. Where'd she go? Looks like Link's a little s s sentimental. There she is. The flow of time is always cruel. Its speed seems different for each person, but no one can change it. A thing that doesn't change with time is a memory of a younger days. Extraneous A there, but I... In order to play... To come back here again, play the... Min, uh, 
Minuet of Forest? Is that how you say that? Minuet? It's better than how I used to say it. Right, so this is the, the way the game allows you to warp between areas. Hello. Mobile live dashboard. Really? Oh, thanks. You've learned the Minuet of Forest. Link, I'll see you again. Where'd she go? Do I understand why Twitch keeps double notifying for your streams? I don't either, but I also don't know why they keep giving me that mobile dashboard when I don't fucking want it. And there's no way to turn that off, either. I looked into it. There is no turning that off. Which is... some goddamn bullshit, I tell you. So anyway, this is the first d d dungeon for, for Doll Link. It's also one of my favorites. I just love the atmosphere in this, in this one area. Ah, yes. Right, there's another Wolfos. Wolfos, draw close to you and watch its movement carefully. Attack when it drops its guard. Alright, I got it. Wolfos ain't shit. Alright, you hear me? These are little bitches. Yeah, boy, I forgot how, like... I forgot how short the hookshot is, man. Not... There is not much in the way of, uh... Length with this fucking thing. Really, though, like, I pulled myself up. What do you mean? <laughs> this music's great. I love it. What am I hearing, though? All right, so I think I can just do this. No, I can't because the hook shot is fucking short as shit. Come on. What do you mean, ting? That, that's wood. It hooks onto wooden things. Got a small key. Alright, there we go. Also, the hookshot can just kill the Sculptulas. Great. Yeah, you notice the, uh, like, the, the symbol for the forest temple does not look like forest. <laughs> it looks like wind. Well, it's, it's because the forest, uh, temple was, was originally the wind temple in, uh, in the beta. This will be brought up later. This game had a weird development. Like, they kept changing ideas constantly. You see bits and pieces of the old, old design here and there. I think it's a good thing, because, like, the whole forest idea, like, fits much better into, in, in, into the lore and shit. That being said, I am kind of, I am kind of curious, like, what the, what the, see what I... Like, their original idea for the Wind Temple, like, might have been. For God.
just shot an Octorok! <laughs> I don't believe I can crawl this wall without the error bow and arrow. I do like how early you get the bow and arrow in this game. Like, it's put the good use immediately. Alright, you know what I can do here. God, it's so foggy, too. Now, this is supposed to be a temple, but it kind of looks like a big castle. It's kind of neat how, like, how it looks. Yeah, so these, uh... Yeah, you notice these temples are a bit more complex and, like, they're larger. Yeah, as I said, like, this is where the game begins. Like, the first three temples, like, that's a tutorial. This is where, this is where, like, the real, this is where the real game begins. Yeah, pots! <laughs> I just love their idea for stairs. It's like, nah, just, like, put textures on it. Yeah, it looks like a stairs, it's fine. And this is where I came from. Lovely. You know... I'm playing a 20 FPS game at like... A 320 by 240, like 20 FPS game at like 720p at 60 frames per second. You know. I think I'm overcompensating the, the fucking encoder for this shit. <laughs> blue bubble. Guard against his blue, blue flare with his shield. I love these things. They're so goddamn goofy. They're so goofy looking. The old skull flaps about in the breeze. Yo, what else flaps around in the breeze? You know, besides these nuts. There are arrows painted on the floor. Really? Thank you, Navi. I would have never noticed. Wow! Yeah, so this is definitely before they censored the Gerudo stuff. Yeah, because it's still using its original, like, um, Crescent Moon design. Yeah, they changed this at some point, because apparently, like, like, the Crescent Moon with the star in the middle is, like, Islamic. And Nintendo was, was afraid of getting sued, so they changed it. There's some fun facts for you. They did the same thing with the Fired Temple's music as well. It originally had some Islamic chanting that they got from some, like, sound library. Uh, that they changed, though. That's, uh, that changes in the version that I have. So we will see- we will hear the censored Fire Temple version, unfortunately. Or, fortunately, I like- I, Depending on how you feel about it. I think it sounds cooler, like, with, with the- with the chanting removed, honestly. You'll see what I mean, like, when we get there. Is anyone else just really enjoying this atmosphere? Like, I love this. I love this and, like, fucking, like... It's a sound design. It's just so good. It's just so mysterious. Fucking looking is inverted. Yeah, no, that does not work. I need the bow and arrow for that. No, it's like some people think they hear screaming in, in 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 this song. Like I don't I don't hear it myself. I 
Block puzzles. I hear more of those blue bubbles around. I d I do really like how the battle music just sort of fades in and out in this version. There he is! Oh, for God's sake. Kill him! <laughs> what is this thing? <laughs> Look at the way his jaw just flaps about in the breeze. I love him. Come here. Oh my God, just kill him. All right, I don't have the... Uh, the necessary components here. And I do believe those bot block but that but that blocks will stay here now. God damn it, I haven't even gotten the fucking map yet. Am I even supposed to be in this area yet? But the music just made me laugh. Not because of the music itself, but because of an argument I saw like people having over it. Can I get up there? Whoop, turn around. What did I just see? Oh. I think I'm here way too early. leads to here. Alright, that's where I came in. I think. Oh yeah, the Forest Temple always trips me up like when I first come here. Every time without fail. Alright, here we go. This looks like progress. Out of here. Now, where did I hear that golden skull dealer? I heard him. Where was he? Ah, there you are. You know, this... I, wait, hold on. Hold the fuck up, I just realized something. I don't need- <laughs> If I get lost, I actually legitimately have help. I busted out my strategy guides. I have them. No, for real. Here, you wanna see it? Here, let me show you. There it is. <laughs> I mean, it's a little banged up, but like... It still has the original, like, price sticker on it, like, by the way, Fantasy Realms, yeah. There it is. It's, it's full page color and everything. <laughs> I love the fucking fonts they use in this goddamn thing, like, look at this. <laughs> this is great. Yeah, anyway. Alright, let's see, which, uh, 
Where's the forest temple? Uh, let's take a look here. <laughs> Wait, hold on. Okay, uh... I'm definitely gonna need this when I go for the Golden Skulltulas. Oh, wow, it has like a full-page spread of like the Hyrule World Atlas. Huh. Like, look at this. Looks great. Yeah, this is awesome. See, this is what I like... Like, they don't make shit like this for, like, games anymore, do they? Magic beans and dirt patches are found in the following areas. Secret grottos. Scarecrow song. Uh, oh, here we go. Here's where you can find all the golden skulltulas. Okay, so it does tell me, but it doesn't really, like, tell me in the area. It just tells you in, like, some weird little patch at, like, the back of the book. Interesting. Anyway. Okay, uh... Quest 2. Here we go. Barn here. Yeah, here we go. Chapter 5, walkthrough, part 2. Quest 1, the forest medallion. Get the hookshot. Lawn Lawn Ranch. Get a Pona. Oh, you can get a Pona. Okay. If it's nighttime when you reach, play the Sun Song. This will cause Ingo to appear by the whole corral. When you speak to Ingo, you'll discover that he is now in charge of Lawn Lawn Ranch. Uh, summon a Pona. Ride around with the Pona for a little while. Then speak to Ingo again. Oh, right, you gotta speak to Ingo before the time is up. Fuck. Ingo's impressed with the riding skills and asked if you would like to race against him. That's it. That's what you gotta do. Fuck, I completely forgot about that step. Uh, here we go. Lost Woods. Learn the minuet of song. Got it. Okay, Forest Temple. Get the fairy bow and defeat Phantom Ganon. Go that way. Alright. I think I'm good from here. Let me just put like a bookmark in here. I also have one for Majora's Mask. Glad I kept these old things. I also have one of like Sonic Adventure. Ah, oh, here we go. Stalfos. Lure it. Lure it close to you and watch its movement carefully. Attack it when it drops its guard. There's two of them too. I love their little hums. <laughs> oh god, it, it, it can, like, attack, like, be on your guard sometimes. Yeah, these test your combat like progress. Looks like fully. Oh. <laughs> There's some stealth foes that have to be, like, defeated that way. Wow, it does. Wow, it hits like a truck. <laughs> Holy crap, I, I forgot how much damage they did. Like, look, I'm already down to like one half a heart. Or, or one heart, I mean. Link, Link seems a little tired. Oh, good, there's a fairy right here. Small key, got it. Got here. All right, now I can go into this other area and go back up to the block area and then like take a piss. Drop a pee pee. Of the, of the overskin is actually there. Let me check something. So I'm not sure if it's because of the capture card, like, or if it's just like the way my TV is, like, is. But I'm noticing like the capture card seems a lot darker than the TV. How does it look on your end? Mario 64 seemed fine. I guess it's alright. I 
What are these little what are these noises? I love these little noises these little sons of bitches make. Yeah, and of course all your all your little items can can do like varying things. Oh, I remember this room. Ah, oh, it's so cool, the fucking, like, twisting mechanic. This corridor is all twisted. It's so cool. You walk down and it goes all brrr. That's so cool. Watch for the shadows of monsters that hang from the ceiling. Yeah, she's not joking either. This is, uh, like the, uh... The wall masters are here. Oh, that's that's a chest. And here they come. Wall master, watch out for for a shadow on the floor. Destroy it before it gets back up the ceiling. Yeah, see ya. Wow, they dropped forty rupees. Okay, well, I'm here. There's a treasure chest here. Yes, I see that. Uh. May have skipped a step. Give me a sec. No. Again, the Force Temple always trips me up. Every time I play this game. Stop it. This thing away from me. What the fuck did I miss? Uh, uh, not much besides the fact that I uh, busted out my old strategy guide and am using it. Because, uh, the Force Temple always fucks me up, like, every time I play it. <laughs> yeah, I, I showed it off, uh, on, on the webcam, but, uh... Since apparently you weren't here, I'll show it off again. Uh, yeah. <laughs> Official strategy guide! I also own, own one for Majora's Mask. Yeah, full color illustrations and everything. I love it. How much is this worth? Seven fifty. I wonder if this is like worth lump, like money these days. Hold on. Did I even go up there? No, I did not. This music feels like it's mocking me. Pretty sure there's something I gotta do in this room. Hmm. Well, that's not it.
Oh, there's a golden skull teal up there. Naughty wife next door, we need your energy. Yeah, no, like, whoever it is, they did, like, think... They responded, they think for the sub. We, we saw the screenshot. And then that was it, but, like, I, I wonder if they're actually, like, watching, because, as I said, like, I, 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 I can watch... I can see the viewer numbers, and it's... I don't know, it... It, 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 it doesn't seem, like, l large enough. Ah, oh, you fuck. That's why I, that's why I, that's why I wondered if they were bots. Nope. What? Why? Can't look straight up with this thing. Whoops. Wait, can I hit it with this? Hmm. I wonder if I could hit the spider like that. Nah, because then... Nah, there's no way. Wait until he's like looking the other way and then I'll just gun it. Too late. Really? That was a puzzle? <laughs> okay. Sure, I'll take it. That can't be, like, the... <laughs> no, that, that can't be the solution to that area. Let me look this up. Okay. Reach a big... Dip the, at the fountain, you'll see a treasure chest. You can't reach to the bottom. Remember that. For return for later. Go up the wall with the vines near the entrance. Before attempting to climb, kill the two Skultulas. You can reach with your hook shot. You will have to sneak past the highest skull wall, Tila, while it's facing away from you. That is what you gotta do. Okay. I don't remember that, but okay. Uh. Right, that is not the way to go. Okay, there we go. Now this looks like progress. Yeah, here we go. That didn't work. Try that again. Damn it. Oh, damn it. Come on. There's gotta be a way up there. Come on. Oh, there we go. You know, I almost said, like, it's it's surprising, but I, it's really not, like, there's kind of, like, a reason why, like, this game is, like, rated so highly. Like, 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 look up, like, different, like, top 100, like, top 10, top 100 games lists, and you'll see this game up always up to high there. It's, it's, it's just well-crafted in, in, like, every regard. 
Like the sound, the sound design, like the t temple design, the enemy design, just everything was top notch. I mean, yeah, it's a little dated these days, but if you can get past that, I mean, yeah, no, this this game is still excellent, and I am. I'm not talking too much. That's because I'm just enjoying it so much, and I just completely fucked up. Why the bars? <laughs> oh, that's fine. I didn't want to go back that way anyway. I'm a fucking. It's fine. I gotta come over here anyway. I kicked your ass enough. Poor Link, I just keep making him, like, bash his head into things. There's a small key. Right, and this just connects these two areas. Pretty sure. Ah. Ah, yeah, that looks good. Okay, so some spots it holds up less well than others. Point still stands. I do notice the fog in this temple seems to like come and go. It's interesting. I just love how mysterious this area is. Like, there's just something about it, like, I'm not entirely sure what it is. Anyway, now I can go back through like the bu that that, uh, that other room. done this. Uh, okay, so I've got the dungeon map, but unfortunately I don't have a compass, so I'm kind of keep checking the wrong place. For... Look at, that, look at that hexagon ass door. Doorknob, I mean. It's great. Yeah, I have a lot of nostalgia for this one. Especially this area, I don't know why, but I remember like getting like really confused and lost here as a kid. But like not winding too much, because the area is just so cool, like... I mean, I mean, with enough trial and error, you would have... Like, you can just eventually get the, like, the flow, but... It's surprisingly non-linear for like the first adult dungeon. Which is technically the fourth dungeon you come across, so yeah, I guess it's not that surprising. <laughs> There we go. Just love the atmosphere of this fucking dungeon, too. It's great. He hits like a tank. This, be, this might be my first actual rip here. Nope. 
Got that, like... Ah, oh, that jump strike of his, though. The problem is, like, it just goes, like, right behind your shield, like, if, if you're too close. There we go. Oh, God. <laughs> Camera almost fucked me up there. Camera's, Camera's still almost fucking me up. But hey, it looks very cinematic. It's alright, I got two fairies. Although that, that noise is going to drive me nuts. Whoa! Right, here's where you got to finish him off. Oh, wait, no, that's right. You got to kill them both, like, like very quickly. Come on. Come on. God damn it, come on. There we go. Holy shit, the game lagged like hell there. <laughs> I've, I've never seen, like, drop so many, like, fucking frames at once. I bet you this era, but it's like, it's... You don't expect, like, playing, like, an original hardware, like, like game like this. Especially Zelda. Because it runs pretty smoothly. The fairy bow. Cool. I don't remember which. Is this it? Bow and arrow. Oh. oh. Am I too close? Yep. I love that little laughing noise. Joel, one of one of the Poe sisters. Aim for her when she appears. Yeah, I really do like how the battles look with the Z-targeting. Like, it's kind of, like, like dynamic in a way. It's a little hard to, like, control sometimes, though. Just like the way it's circling around your opponent's kind of neat. I like how he just kicks the chest open. Alright, another small key. Yeah, we're making progress! Alright, here's, here's another Poe sister.
Oh boy, the analog stuff's gonna drive me nuts here. So here we go, another one of another one of these battles. Hold on, can I just use my sword? Or do I have to use the uh, the bow and arrow? Oh, I guess I can just fucking like do that. Yeah, that's probably uh, that'll probably do a lot more damage than the fucking bow and arrow will. Oh, I never noticed this, but like the fire is actually like emanating blue light and that's like appearing on Link. <laughs> the fucking details, I love it. Looks great. That sound. You found the compass. I can see locations. Blah, 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 blah. Cool. I can all see the room we're in, too. Interesting. All right. This area almost feels like a mansion, but then, like, the, the exterior also, like, from, reminds me of a castle. So, in short, I have no idea what the fuck the Forest Temple actually is. I don't think anyone else does either. Yes, yes, watch out for the shadows. Like, shut! Shut face! I like how they stop forming, like, if you, if you if you go into a ladder, because that would be extremely beans if one just formed while you're just on a ladder. Okay. Alright. Green bubble, use your sword when its green fire vanishes. I could. I can do that. God damn it. <laughs> and that's another fucking locked door. Right, there was a chest back there. Hmm. Definitely missed something. Keep missing these chests. Wait, hold up. That's not the chest that I need. I need to go down the stairs. Cool. So now I have the uh, the bow and arrow. Can lock some new areas with this. the eye I gotta shoot? Is it in here? No, there's an eye part of this puzzle. God, I just love the way it twists. It's so cool. No, no, here it is. There we go. That's a pretty clever little uh, little puzzle there. And I hear the wall master. You got the boss's key. Now you can go inside the chamber where the boss lurks. Mm-hmm. Yay! All this money I can't use.
Hit him. Oh, for fuck's sake. Yeah, I know where we are. It's cold all the time. A good aim, asshole. There we go. Oh god, the way the camera points downward while you're on a cliff like annoys me. So which way? I think this way. Floor master. When it splits up, destroy all the pieces before they reunite. Your fucking hand. Fuck. Oh god. Nope. Get it off. Ah, kill it. Yeah, there's the key I was looking for. Oh, good. We're going to be hearing beeping for a while. And then back to this room. Oh, for God's sake, I just I just dropped right onto him. Yeah, I guess I I guess I am a bit more tired than I expected. Boy, boy, Mario really took it out of me, didn't it? <laughs> like, I'm not the only one who, who's no, who's who's noticing and had just like, ay ay ay. I blame Rainbow Road. Fuck that course. Need more big dick energy. I agree. Thanks for the bundle of arrows. <laughs> That's a camera angle. All right. Well, I know where to go anyway, so. That is not the way to go. I mentioned this before, but it's kind of hard to believe that, like, this game is built off of off the same engine that also powered, uh, Mario 64. No, really, it's, uh, well, heavily modified. I mean, extremely modified. Nearly, that was nearly death. That's a fuck Rainbow Road, yes, yes. Also, this game's... It's just relaxing, and I don't have a, a lot of commentary for it. So... I mean... <laughs> oh well! <laughs> I'm, I am enjoying myself, though. I'm, I, guess, I guess I'm more tired than I expected. Ah yes, that's, this is exactly where I want to be. Where I want to be. So if I seem a bit more quiet than usual, blame Mario sixty four. Drop a heart. Drop. 
Ah, uh, yes, thanks for the money I can't hold. But yeah, it's just kind of the Nintendo engine, right? Yeah, more or less. There's a bunch of whole bunch of the Yeah, probably. It's just highly flexible, highly modular. So if they completely decompiled Mario 64 and we have the actual source code on top of it, how hard would it be to, like, look into Zelda and do the same for this? Uh, no, wait, what, what am I saying? We have the source code for Zelda. Well, bits and pieces of it. Oh, I cannot wait for them to, like, do the same thing to Mario 64 that they did, did to this game. Hopefully. I'm, I'm waiting for that, actually. The day that comes out, I'm gonna, like, just buckets of... of the oceans will turn white. It's my Z! Is there an eye somewhere? Okay. Anyone, anyone else tired, tired of the beeping? Uh, I'm gonna make Link drink some white stuff. That is not a bottle. That is not a bottle. The fucking bottles in this game look horrific. Every time I see it, I even as a kid, I'm, I was like, "What the fuck is that?" Watch out! Come! Oh, there it is. He said it. This puzzle took me a little. I mean, I mean, as a kid, like you don't expect that you can do this, but you totally can. I wasn't right on the eye, but close enough. Can't legally do anything with the leaked source of code, so it's as good as useless. Yeah, get, 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 fall into the slime like a dickhead. That that's his, no, that's 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 the best course of action. I mean, yeah, legally, but and just do it underground and then like release it. Like then then they can't do anything. The point is, I want to see. I mean, it can still help a little bit, right? I want to see like de decompilations of other games. <laughs> Fuck! Did you know Sonic Two was decompiled at some point, and people are uh, making ROM hacks of that game actually. Yeah, I was looking at that code. That is, uh, brutal. You know, we can't do dick with it. I mean, not, not with that attitude, you can't. Okay, so... We want to fall now. Oh, I remember this room. This room's neat. So where does that go? It goes there. Right, this just leads back out here. Right, hey, let's play the Scarecrow song. Nope, no particular reason. Damn it. <coughs> nice song. Oh! Right, right. I, it's it won't actually work until I go talk to the scarecrow first. Fuck, I forgot about that step. Ay, 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 ay. This is a fun little area. Link, watch out! The ceiling is falling down. What? Whoa, what? Huh. I think this is the only time in the game where you could do something like this. And this... You know what this reminds me of? This reminds me of, like, a few of the beta screenshots where Link's running around, like, holding out the bow like this. Oh, nice. That's really cool! Because normally it always goes in the first person, so you can aim it. I never noticed that about this room. Holy shit. 
and then fall again, so as I can hit that other Skulltula. Ah, yes, I see. Kind of neat. Yeah, there's a reason why, uh... You're not, uh... Like... You know, you, you normally go into first person, because, you know, you want to be able to aim with the fucking bow. Now, this always stressed me out. It's really not that hard, but it just... It, yeah. Here, form the puzzles! I think this is one of those things where you can just get, like, fucked really hard on, like, the RNG. Oh, damn it. Ooh, this is gonna be tight. Why do they only give you a minute to do this? Fuck me, man. Yeah, look, now the green is like, like the fire is green on, on Link. Neat. That's another like detail I've never noticed. Boy. Let me tell you, like, like getting the TV out and actually playing this on the TV, like, it's... It, it, it was a good decision. It was a really good decision. Like, the game looks wonderful. On a CRT. It would look even better on a, on, a, on, a, on a CRT that doesn't suck cock, but hey, you know what? I, I, I'll take what I can get at this point. <laughs> oh my god. How much do those, like, good Sony CRT costs? Like, you know, the one with all the knobs and tubes where I can adjust every value and that take, like, true, like, RGB signal? How much do those cost? Like, like, I always proofs, like, the, uh, like, the, uh, the threads on CRT and, like, uh, the chans and shit. But I, I always get, like, you know, like, like, they cost, they cost money. MONEY! I ain't made a cash! MONEY! Hi, good morning. How you guys doing? CURRENCY! Now it is a venerable fortune, yeah. I'm unfortunately. Oh god, I remember this one. Uh, how do I tell which one's real? Wow, this is making the game like... And Meg, one of the Poe sisters, you need to find out which one is the real one. Alright, it's whichever one is, uh... ...moving. You know, I didn't think the game would be able to, like, lag... Any heavier than what it did earlier, but it's it's doing it right now. Oh, you. I noticed too late. You. This ain't too hard. Just need to keep her cool. God, the game is lacking so badly. Not as badly as earlier, where like the the, the the game legitimately dropped to like two FPS. What the fuck was that about? Oh, this is cool. Wee. 
Holy fuck. Also, you have to mod it for RGB. Yeah, but that's not a problem. <laughs> you know, if, if I was getting, like, the CRT monitor, yeah, I'd want to mod, mod it for RGB as well. Like, I'm balls in at that point. I mean, uh, if I wanted to keep using the N64 hardware like that, and I, if I had the money, I'm going to buy, like, one of those special co N64 controllers that are shaped like a real controller. <laughs> That's not nice. Yeah, I'm going to get one of those, uh, f uh who, who and I forget who they made it. Hori? Is it Hori? But they make a better N64 controller. Like, it's it, it's actually, like, shaped like something, like, sensible in the analog stick better. But they cost a lot of money because they, uh... Well, they're specialty, so... It's a neat little puzzle. Unsure whether you can get S card on an NTSC Ed 64. Hmm. Well, I mean, then there must be a way to do it. I, okay, it, 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 it doesn't have to be like pure RGB, but just having a good CRT would make even composite signals look good. I mean, not the best, obviously, but a bit better. But I've seen like what like a real like like a true RGB like composite like uh, CRT like looks like. It's beautiful. Makes me want to throw my hands up and shit. I only need the strategy guide once. Twice. Okay, make that three times. No, it's fine. I got this. Damn, I already hit that switch. Fuck. Oh yeah, the boss of this um, uh, uh, of this of this temple is actually pretty cool, and that's that thing. Okay, then the other switch has to be over here. There it is. Trinitrons are over hundred bucks on eBay, and you know the shipping will be expensive too. Oh yeah. No, I wouldn't. I wouldn't use eBay to buy a CRT. I I would not trust shipping, especially today. I've been uh, uh, I've been getting every box that I've gotten in the mail is just banged up, like beyond like belief. So I uh, yeah, I would not buy anything like like a CRT on 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 eBay unless it's local pickup. This is such a cool boss, by the way. The Triforce on the floor. This God, the atmosphere is just so good. Look at the way Link is lit. Oh my god. There he is. Ah, oh, it's Ganondorf already. Those things are pretty robust to be free. Yeah, but uh, again. I would rather get, like, local pickup if I can get away with it. Evil Spirit from Beyond, Phantom Ganon. Right, so we have to pay attention to the portraits and hit him, like, when he comes out of them. It's pretty, it's a pretty cool, this is a pretty cool boss. Okay, I hear him. Yep, there he is. Uh, I see him multiple times, actually. Here it is. He 
people ship glass panel PC cases without getting broken, and those aren't as robust as here, too. You just want to make sure the seller packs it well. Problem is, I'm not sure you'll have any luck finding it locally. Yeah. Well, this isn't a uh, problem that I'm gonna have to like worry about for a while, so. This one. Right, it's time to play, uh, it's time to play the tennis. Ow. I love the boss battles in this game. Oh, you fucker. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, I'm just musing about it, yeah. As I said, I want to. Like, not like... I... Don't don't forget, it's... I, I, I preceded it with the... Uh, oh, but you've only defeated my phantom. When you fight the real me, it won't be so easy. What a worthless creation that ghost was. I will banish it to the gap between dimensions. Jesus. Don't fuck with Ganondorf. Anyway, I preceded it with, uh, when I have the time and money. Okay, I might have not said time, but I meant to say time. Like, you know, you know. It's definitely in the hobbyist thing. Oh, God, I have so many, like, projects that I want to do. Like, I also want to, uh... I want to fucking, uh... Get a, uh... I want to build a classic computer someday. Like, I mean, like, build a computer that's straight out of, like, 2000 and... 2000 to, like, 90s and install, like, DOS on it and shit. Where did the FFZ player stats go? What? It, it should be there. Did Twitch break it again? Let me check. Hey, sorry. Thank you. Because of you, I could awaken as a sage. Let's see it. Hold on, Tech. It could be an option, but I'm kind of in in the, in the middle I'm of some. Kind of in in the, in the middle I'm of some. Kind of in, in the middle of some. Kind of in, I, I mean, I, I see it under the stream. Yeah, I don't know, man. Hmm. Yeah, I don't see it in that list either. But, like, I don't normally use that list anyway. Like, I always just, like... Remember, I don't use theater mode, so I just have, like, the list under, uh... Under the, like, the player itself, so... Like, that's the... I thought that you were talking about that, but... Okay. Looks like they're... Looks like they're fucking about with it again. Mm. I am sorry, uh, The Sage of the Forest Temple. I always believed that you would come. <laughs> because I know you. No. You don't have to explain it to me. Because it is destiny that you and I can't live this in the same world. She looks so serene. I will stay here and help. I will stay here as a forest sage and help you. Now please, take this medallion. Oh, I heard, uh, in o Ocarina of Time 3D, like, these are right in your face, and it's, like, kind of cool. 
you know. Of course, I didn't see that because I didn't. I you know I had a 2DS, but you know still. You received the Force Medallion. Soraya adds, a, awakens as a sage and adds her power to yours. Sorry, will always be your friend. Oh, ain't that nice? Hey, it's the Dicku tree. He dead. The motherfucker dead. What's this? <laughs> Look at Link, he's so curious. Look at his little earrings. He's gonna have to change them tight little white uh, leggings there. Hi there! I'm the Deku Tree Sprout. Magic. Fuck. Fuck off. Because you and Zarya broke the curse on the Force Temple, I can grow and flourish. Thanks a lot! Look how cute he is. Look at your face. Hey, have you seen your old friends? None of them recognized you with your grown up body, did they? That's because the Kokiri never grow up. Even after seven years, they're still kids. You must be wondering why only you have grown up. Well, as you might have already guessed, you are not a Kokiri. You're actually a Hylian. <gasps> what? No way. I am happy to finally reveal the secret to you. How do you know all this? You are literally born five seconds ago. Holy shit. Some time ago, before the King of Hyrule unified our, this country, there was a fierce war in our world. This is dark. This is some dark backstory, by the way. One day, to escape from the fires of the war, a Hylian mother and her baby boy entered this forbidden forest. The mother was gravely injured. Her only op her only choice was to entrust the child to the Deku Tree, the guardian spirit of the forest. The Deku Tree could sense that this was a child of destiny. Destiny and quest. Whose fate would affect the entire world. So he took him into the forest. After the mother passed away, the baby was raised as a Kokiri. And now, finally, the day of destiny has come. And I'll be a guide on your quest. Sorry. You are a Hylian, and we're always bound to leave this forest. And now, you have learned your own destiny. So you know what you must do. That's right, you must save the land of Hyrule. Now Link, break the curses on all the temples and return peace to Hyrule. Cool. Hi there, I'm... Okay. I can grow and flourish. Thanks a lot. Okay, that's, that's all you have to say, yeah? Oh, look how cute he looks. He, he, that face kind of reminds you of Cupel from, like, Skies of Arcadia. I don't know. Is that, like, a Japanese trope that I'm not aware of? Nice Z-fighting, by the way. Yeah, that looks great. <laughs> Oops. <laughs> so how does this work? Will just, like, the... Will the new one grow in front of the old one? Will, will there just be always be a corpse of a Deku tree, like, behind the new one? Or will the new one uh, absorb the old one? And uh, how does this work? Well, it's fucking magic. All right, FM. Who cares? I love how I love how quick it is to save. Alright, so, one last thing I want to do before I, uh, before I go, I want to go uh, rescue Epona. Now that the Deku tree sprout is growing in the great Deku tree's meadow, the forest has returned to normal. My name is fucking Hoof. Be a guide in your quest. All I can think of now. Teach me some fancy fe fencing. All I've ever done is tap B all my life. You're a weird boy. Look at this motherfucker. Blink. I wonder if he will come back. I did. Also, close your legs, you fucking mutt. Filthy son of a bitch. Okay, is there anything else I can do in there right now? 
Hyrule Field. Good old Hyrule Field. All right. I guess I just gotta go how big Hyrule Field is, but at times it's just like, oh, I just want to run across it quickly, please. This really is the fastest way to like move, by the way. <laughs> this is this is one of those speedrunner tricks I will use because it's just legit useful. Well, it's not like dusk anymore, so like there you go. That's a thing. All right, so now that I know what to do, I can do it. Like paying this asshole like tons of money. Yes, ride. No, I, I, thank you. I know how to ride the goddamn horse. Whoa, camera, please. All right, so I need to talk to. I need I need to ride around for a little bit. Then talk to, to Ingo. B before it ends. This fucking music is just... Really, it's just like perfect horse music. Like, I... You're getting better! How about a little race with me? One lap around the coral with that horse. Let's make a little wager. Say 50 rupees? Yeah, all right. Yeah, all right. How about I mush your ass in the mud, buddy? <laughs> what was that? Yay! Beat ya. Link <laughs> slaps his horse's ass. She shoots! I love this animation. Holy shit. If the great Ganondorf found out about this humiliation... Hey, you, how about another race? If you win, you can keep the horse. Oh, you bet. Playing dirty, are we? Nope. Nope. No, you don't. Fucking banjo ass music. <laughs> Just right in the camera now. What's up with that horse? Is that a Pona? How did you tame that wild horse right under my nose? I was going to present that horse to the great Ganondorf. But I bet it on the race and lost! Shoot! <laughs> As I promised, I give you the horse I give the horse to you. However, I'll never let you leave this ranch. Well now you're just being a sore loser. You're gonna let you're gonna open that door right now, mister. Oh, you're gonna get arrowed. Why does that make the horse like? Ha ha ha! Uh oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Cool. Right. So now what you got to do is uh, it's quite simple. You just uh, jump the fucking fence. <laughs> yeah. Here we go. And there's Epona. We now have the horse. That's awesome. Cool. Yeah, so now we have a Pona. 
Okay, I'm gonna take a quick detour down to Lake Hylia so I can, uh... Unlock that scarecrow. Haha, <laughs> <laughs> fuck that dumbass ranger. Yeah, that's what I thought the first time, too. It's like, yeah, fuck you, Wingo. Right, so now there's Poe's all throughout this, uh... This field, and uh, if you bottle them up, like, you can, like, earn some money. Not that I need it right now, but I don't know. There we go. And right over the fence. Awesome. What if you go back and talk to him from outside? Um, I'll, I'll, I'll show what happens in, in a little bit, but uh, he, he's basically lost his mind at this point. He does not take it well. Hmm. Have I mentioned that you're basically invincible on the horse? Basically. Oh, for God's sake. Turn around. Oh, just... Go get him. Run him over. Yeah! Hey, aren't you the fairy buddy I met a long time ago? Wow, you grew, dude! Well, here's your song. What? No, I never forget. You! You're the one who forgot, aren't you? If you have an ocarina, play that song, baby! Yeah, you did forget it, didn't you? Hey, it's the ocarina! Play that song with it, baby! You bet. Ah, oh, what a song. Beautiful. Oh, yeah! <laughs> That's it! That's the tune! You rock! I'm blown away! Oh, no, no, I didn't forget the song! I never forget anything! But I just feel like rewarding you, baby! Stop calling me baby, you're... that's gross. I have a good idea. My buddy Pierre is wandering around. What? So play that tune when you want to call him. I'll tell him to help you if he's nearby and hears that song, baby. And there we go. The Scarecrow has been unlocked. And I will show you exactly what the point of that is. It's kind of cool. It took me a while to figure it out, too. Oh. Yeah, it's a miracle of life. Hey guys, I got a cock in my pocket. Hey! Sorry. By the way, this is what you do. When my controller wants to like work, that is. And there we go. Summons Pierre, and this is the point of it. You you can summon Pierre and then like, like use him to hook shot onto like new areas. This is a hidden thing, so like like this is all optional. Uh. Uh oh. Got it. Awesome. <laughs> Fucking keys. Come here. Yeah, get out of here. Got it. Uh. Oh, uh, look at this geometry. Just a heart container up here. Uh, I got a question. Did I pick up the heart container in uh, the, the uh, forest temple? I think I did. <laughs> I don't remember doing it. I sort of do, but not really. I'm gonna have to watch the footage later. <laughs> wow. Oh yeah, I forgot that like highly is all like drained. Yeah, you gotta like restore the water, cause like uh, Zora's domain's all like dried up, well, frozen actually. We don't have to worry about this now. Fuck it. Get the birds out of. Oh, it's a Gwei. Destroy it before it flies into you. Does that count? Hey, you're fine, Link. Jesus. Okay, yeah, I'm I'm here way too early. I just wanted to get the uh, the scarecrow. Hello there, son. I'm researching the process of making medicine, but me okay, yeah. 
Yeah, I've already read your dialogue. It, nothing's changed here in seven years. Literally nothing. It's still the same old creepy dude. Oh, done. Okay, I gotta give Ocar Ocarina of Time some credit. That is a really good shadow. I mean, it's not real time or anything, but it looks really good. And look, it's it, it, it conforms. It conforms to the actual sign. That That's advanced for a game like this. I gotta admit, like, I completely forgot about that. I hate these things. Right, so where did I leave Epona? Oh, well. So this is how you call the horse to you. You play Epona song, of course. Anyway, let's go back into the ranch and I'll, uh, I'll show you what happens to Ingo. And then I'll, I'm going to call it after that. Whoa. -ho -ho. I think Navi just, like, tried to, like, tutorial me again. Sometimes the horses don't want to do. There you go. You gotta be at the right angle sometimes, or it just won't. The horse won't do. I don't know how else to like explain it other than just that. <laughs> yeah, the horse just doesn't. I mean, the horse could. The horse could do, but she she just doesn't feel like it. Oh, for fuck's sake. Of course, you can't jump anything without carrots. Okay. Okay, so maybe the horse is... The horse is a little harder to control than, I'm, than I remember, but, you know. Oops. There's one of those pose. Oh, you bitch. Yeah, they yeah they fade in and out really quickly. Yeah, it's hard to hard to get to them. What 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 do you want? Yeah, yeah. I know I got to go to Death Mountain next. Shut up. Uh. There we go. So, uh, so Ingo is, uh, he's, uh, well, uh, well, just look at him. He seems, uh, really happy. Mr. Ingo, have you been hitting the funny juice again? <laughs> Hi there, how are you? I'm Ingo. I feel so honored to be allowed to work here. Yeah, yeah, he just... <laughs> denial of the highest form. Let's see what Malin has to say. Uh, hmm. Malin's not in here. He's around somewhere. Yeah, I need to buy a, uh, one of, one of them rum rumble packs for the N64, because, uh... Oh, there she is. He's just over here singing. Uh, ventriloquisting. Okay, I was going to point out the, the Bowser necklace, but, um... Holy crap. <laughs> I forgot how, uh... It, anyway. Thank you very much for the other day. I haven't even asked you your name yet. Really? Link! That's what I thought. You're the fairy boy from the forest. That was years ago. Do you remember me? You do? Well, I'm sure it was... Y it was you, because opponent remembered you. Oh, I have to tell you about Mr. Ingo. He was afraid that the evil king might find out that Epona had been taken away. It really upset him. But one day, all of a sudden, he went back to being a normal, nice person. Now my dad is coming back. I can't believe it. But peace is returning to this ranch. It's all because of you. I owe you so much. Thank you. Thank you, Link. How is Epona doing? If you play Epona's song with your ocarina, she will surely come to you. Please come back to the ranch whenever you want to train Epona. Can too. Um, 
This is a really tough training course where you have to like jump over a bunch of shit. And uh... I don't wanna... I don't wanna do it because it's a pain in the ass! <laughs> Remember how I said the horse, uh, if you're not at the right angle, the horse will just stop dead in the tracks? Well, imagine ha imagine doing like a, a course around the, uh, the, the, uh, the, the outside perimeter with a bunch of those jumps. Where any one of those jumps and you fail the challenge. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's a great combination of the horse is finicky and here's a bunch of shit that can go wrong. It, it, it's it's unintentionally one of the hardest challenges in this fucking game and I, I, I don't want to do it. I don't want it. Oh. Hmm. Fucking box puzzle. But you get more carrots. You don't need more carrots. There's no point to like having more carrots. Also, you just looked that up, didn't you? I mean, I'm not saying I won't try, but I'm just saying, like, don't expect me to actually be able to finish it. No, I just knew it. How? Tech, you never played this game, have you? I don't- I don't remember, like, I don't remember you saying you played this game. Ah. Uh. Okay, I'm not gonna question how this works, but okay. Hold on. Right, that doesn't work because I'm an adult now. Watched multiple streams of it. Oh. Okay. Fuck it. You want, want to see me attempt it? I'll do it. You should play this game at least once, though. Like, honestly, it's... 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 Like, I don't believe in those MUST PLAY TOP TEN COCK YEAH! You know, the, the, those fucking... Those lists, but, um, yeah, I, I would definitely rank Ocarina of Time up there. Like, I don't think I could make, like, a off the top of my head, my a top ten list right now, but, like, Sonic 3, Skies of Arcadia, Ocarina of Time, Slash Majora's Mask. You know, I, I, I'd say, I, I, I lump both of them because they're so similar, but I'd say play both. Uh, what else? Sonic the Hedgehog, the movie. Hi. Just, uh, Deus Ex. <laughs> that's, a, that's a wonderful game right there. Uh, what else? Super Mario World, Super Metroid. Metroid Prime, maybe? Epona looks great. Looks like you were able to tame her, too. How about trying your skill with Epona on an obstacle course? I'll time you for two laps. It's pretty challenging. If you miss jumping a fence in the proper order, you'll fail. How about it? Do you want to try? Yeah, let's do it. The current record is 50 seconds. First, try to beat this record. If you can beat the record, I'll give you a present. Do it, give it your best shot, okay? All right, let's get started. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. It's not one lap, it's two. Here we go. Okay, I'm doing good. Yeah, doing good so far. Okay. This is this this is the hard one. All right. No, this is the motherfucker. Really? Why though? Let's, let's do it again. Wow, she made it that time. It's almost like you can't be directly on, you have to be slightly off. One more lap, alright. Input lag. I'm playing a CRT. No, it's the horse! It's the way the mechanics of the fence jumping shit works. You have been listening to me complaining about, like, the, the, the fence jumping, right? Like, what the fuck?! 20 FPS. Okay, yeah, but still. No, the horse just doesn't fucking jump the fence sometimes. Why doesn't she jump the fence? You understand why I didn't the fucking shit? 
I'm pissed. Wow, great! Your time was one minute thirteen seconds. You had to. <laughs> Do it again. I'm doing this shit. I'm pissed. I'm fucking bullshit. Unless it doesn't cost poopies. That's a good way of saying it. God damn. You know what sucks too? Like I have like n like no way of like like making it easier on myself. Like there is no save states here. There's got to be some, like, trick to, like, making that, like, shot every time. Look. Okay, I'm gonna- I'm, I'm just gonna go for the middle. Oh, yeah, look, she made it that time! First try, baby! Yeah, busted ass fence is right here. <sighs> Let me look up- I got the strategy guide here. Let me- Let me see what this fucking book says. Alright, um... I might have to go back a little. Uh, okay, here we go. Re-enter Lon Lon Ranch and meet Ma Malin at the Coral. Malin is impressed with opponent, is no longer afraid. If you talk to Malin a second time and she will tell you to, that you can try your skills. Okay, that's so... Uh, this is tougher than it sounds. It may take you a few tries to succeed. Yeah, especially when the FENCE IS BROKEN! Once you successfully beat the Coral record, Malin sends a reward to your house. When you return home to see the prize you, you have earned, you will find a Lon Lon cow in your house. Now you can revisit your house and have an un unending supply of milk to refill your life energy by heart by five hearts. Is that all the game gives you? Because honestly, I don't give a flying fuck in, in that case. Okay, here we go. Tip. Use a carrot to increase your speed. It's best to use them just before attempting to jump a high fence in order to clear it. Don't use too many carrots too quickly. Though, or you'll run out. The carrots will refill, but it takes longer if you use up the entire row. If you leave one or two, the others will refill faster. Could have sworn you get. No, I don't remember ever getting more carrots, Tech. I don't know what you saw, but that. I've never heard of that mechanic. Official strategy guide. Hey, it works. Brady Games, baby. Font sucks, though. Boy, this... I wish this was in better condition, honestly. Right. I'm doing it. I'm gonna fucking do it. I want that cow. I'm gonna get that cow and I'm gonna milk that cow, baby. Oh, yeah. Mandela effect. No, no, like, we've been over this, the Mandela effect is, 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 is a whole, like, group sensation, like, what, what you got is false memory. How do I quit? How do I leave? Hmm. I'm not the only one, really. Oh, so it is a Mandela effect. I missed that one. Sorry. I, uh, I hate this. I hate this thing. I hate it. I'm leaving. <laughs> you know what the worst part is? There's no easy way to just quit. Like, I can't just, like, exit the horse. And she refuses to jump, like, she refuses to jump the fence. I want to start over, goddammit! Game won't even give me that! Where's Malin? How do I quit? Oh, I know how to quit. 
Yeah, here's how you quit. Great. Well, that was Zelda. <laughs> Thank you all for tuning in. <laughs> oh my god. Hold on. I have to turn the microphone back around now. Give me a sec. Alright. Come on. There we go. There we have it. Okay, this setup's kind of neat, but man, it's gonna be a pain in the ass in the long run. I gotta find a better way to do this. <sighs> yeah, that's enough Zelda for tonight. This is not going to be fun to edit later. Oh, shit. <laughs> uh. Yeah, see, look. Fucking white tape. Yeah. I love the, the fucking box for this, by the way. Scrape your knuckles. Catch some tails. Like, what do you mean? <laughs> anyway. Okay. All right, well, anyway, <laughs> I smacked the remote on the on the microphone pretty hard, didn't I? I didn't even mean to do that either. It just it just happened. Okay. <laughs> told you, I told you about that like horse bullshit. Like I just I I I, I cannot put up with it because it's not my fault that I failed. I, it's the game being bullshit. That's one of the worst things to do to me in a video game, is do that, because at that point, I just say, well, you're not gonna play fair, I'm not gonna fucking play at all. Done. So. <laughs> Fuck it. I, I refuse to, to, to like, to, to do that tango. Thank you.